Christmas. Welcome to my home. Come on in. Hey guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 13. So it is 4.57 and I'm totally off of my Vlogmas schedule, but I'll get back on track tomorrow because we've just been lazy today, haven't we Keith? So Keith and I, we have something that we're gonna show you and we're gonna test it out for you. Okay Keith, show them what it is. It's Reese's Peanut Butter Cup with potato chips. <laughs> Have you guys ever heard of that? Reese's peanut butter cup with potato chips. That sounds disgusting. So it's, we're gonna try a taste test. I have never ever seen this before and just Keith came across it. We had to go to the store and pick up a few things. But yeah, no, cut it in half. Okay. <laughs> okay. That's what it looks like on the inside. It just smells like a regular. It's not getting in focus. Okay, wait, do it like that. Okay. There you go. I don't see the potato chips, do you? No. It smells like a regular Reese cup. Okay. I guess it just gives it crunch because I can't mm -hmm. taste it. Mm -hmm. Wait, you know what? Yeah, it's crunchy, very peanut buttery. You know what? It's saltier. That's what it is. Mm -hmm. You think? It just makes it more salty. When you bite into it. I like it. Not bad. I didn't think I was going to like it. Mm -hmm. That's the difference. It's saltier. Hey, can you show them what you picked up at the at the dollar store. It's a Christmas glass. Yeah, I couldn't. It's the most wonderful time for a beer. <laughs> there you go. You know what? Would you buy these Reese cups again? I would. Yeah, I would. It's crunchy. Like if we get Dunkin' Donuts or Krispy Kreme Donuts, Keith always goes for the kind with the sprinkles because he likes the crunch. This is the cutest, sweetest little bag. I love it, you guys. I'm gonna have to get another one. A long shot. How's that sound? Very French. Okay guys, so we are starving. It's 4.43. We had some breakfast this morning. So we're just gonna Clean out the fridge, right Keith? Yep. So we have some spinacopita, we have some leftover steak, some mac and cheese. I could make a salad, but. Okay, right. we got some potted meat. <laughs> I, honestly, I'm just good with some spinacopita. Since it's 4.44, it's time for some wine. Watch uh, Sex in the City. Yeah, you guys, we're gonna watch the Sex in the City thing. I ruined it. And Keith ruined it for me. And I'm not gonna say what he told me. Cause Autumn and Winnie already saw it. And I knew something bad happened and then Keith blabbed it out. <laughs> but we're gonna watch that. We always like to eat in front of the TV. And uh, yeah, so that's what we're gonna watch, you guys, and I'm so worried about, I mean, I'm just, oh, I'm just so upset that he blew it because I was trying not to read about it and stuff. But anyway, oh, and check out my cute little coach headband. I love it, you guys. I got it from the, I think I got it from the regular coach store.
It's the most wonderful time for a beer. <laughs> Better? There's some chicken and parents. Cheers, you guys. It's the most wonderful time for a beer. So here's what I'm excited about, you guys. It is 49 degrees outside, and it's really starting to feel so Christmassy, isn't it, Keith? Mm -hmm. I just... You guys, what did you think about Autumn's video yesterday? It was hilarious where she was dressed up like Winnie. I mean, or like Gwenny. She has her mannerisms. She had the accent, everything. I thought that was the best Vlogmas video to date. I really enjoyed it. So it was really good. If you guys haven't seen it, you need to go watch. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Something about kids jingle belling and something, something. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know that either. All right. Get that spanakopita nice and hot. I'm just now turning the trees on for the evening. It really sucks when it gets dark at 4.30. I think I might have to get one of those fancy trees like Winnie got next year. <laughs> Okay guys, so I'll see you guys in just a bit. Okay guys, so we are gonna sit down, we're gonna watch Sex in the City and have our dinner. And also I have a couple of things to show you from my falling off the wagon haul. Oh yes I do. I'll be back in a bit. What you doing? Making my whiskey sauce for my bread pudding. Oh, whiskey sauce. So Keith makes bread pudding every year at Christmas. And he made it yesterday. Yeah. So tell him what all you put in your whiskey sauce. Heavy cream, milk, sugar, and bourbon. Mmm. How much bourbon? Three fourths of a cup. Wow. It was a hit last year, wasn't it? It was. Yeah. All right, guys. I think we're going to go ahead and do the advent calendar since we're in here in the kitchen and then I'll go upstairs. I have a couple things to show you guys. So it's advent calendar time. Calendar square. <laughs> it's advent calendar time. All right, Keith, do the honors. We're behind again. What's, what are we to? We are up to number 11. <gasps> 11. These go to 11. And it looks like we have. It's like a little crescent shape. So we have to find it on the back, crescent shape. Looks like it's milk chocolate covered. I'm gonna go with almond praline raindrop. I thought we'd already did that one. No, because I mean, we had one that was kind of nougaty. Does it have nuts in it? Mm-hmm. This one does? So what is it? Not a fan. What is it? I think it's the almond praline drop or whatever it's called. I mean, it's not bad. Not my favorite. It's not my favorite either. It has an almond. <laughs> he puts a little extra in for good measure. Right, Key? No. Go by the recipe. Okay. It has an. Alexa, stop. You stop? It has. An almond extract flavor is what it is. It's like, I think there was a little crunch of a nut in there, but not really a nut. Sometimes you feel like a nut, sometimes you don't. 
Keith, we're behind. You're going to have to come do another one. You can do it, Alan. I'm busy. <laughs> Alright, so number 12. You'll have to read it. I don't have any glasses. Number 12. Ooh. That one looks fancy. Get it out of there. That is the coffee feather. I thought it was a leaf. Is that supposed to be a feather? Coffee feather. Okay. You want to buy it? Sure. Okay. I need some water. I need to cleanse my palate. I can't focus on this thing. I've had better. Have you now? Okay. Mm. 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 That's my least favorite one out of the entire can. Key. This is my least favorite one out of the entire calendar. Yeah, it's pretty bad. I don't even want to eat the rest. Mm -mm. No, that one wasn't good. It's kind of like they started out with a bang. And ever since the, the ones that were minty. <laughs> I don't know. It's just going downhill, guys. That's all I got to say. Downhill. Are you going to put that on the bread pudding now? No, I'm going to put it in the crock pot. Too. Oh, and take it. Oh, okay. Oh, so they can put how much ever they want on it? Yeah. Hmm. Maybe I'll put a little extra whiskey in the morning in case something didn't evaporate. <laughs> What'd you say? I'll put a little more whiskey in it in the morning in case some of it evaporated. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That could happen. This is <laughs> this is the most real vlogmas of all. Just us in the kitchen. Eating, drinking, and hanging out. Mm. Alright guys, let's go upstairs and I have a little something something to show you. Okay, I'm up here in my office and it is a mess. We might have to come up here and clean it. I keep saying that and I, yeah, you don't want to see this. Um, I was going to decorate for Christmas, but I haven't been filming up here. I just came up here because there's a couple of things I want to show you. And this is from my Falling Off the Wagon series. So when we were in Panama City and I was Christmas shopping, you know me, you guys, I, I can't help myself. Okay. We were shopping at Dillard's, and I had to pick this up. Now, before I show it to you, I just want to say that I did not copy Autumn Beckman. She's going to say I did, but I didn't. It's from this brand here, and it's this bag, okay? So this is the um, little nylon bag. What's this called? I can't even remember you guys, but I love the just leopard spots on it. It's black, but yet, you know, it has a little something, something extra on it. And it was on sale. These were like, I think these were like 40% off, something like that. So I bought some gifts and then I had to pick this one up for myself. And I have the Prada bag, just the nylon bag, and it's smaller than this. Actually, I wish the Prada nylon bag were this size because this is a perfect size everyday bag. And I've used my little Prada bag quite a bit, like for going out, but that's about all it's good for. So I got that, and then I got one more. I, oh my gosh, I about died when I saw this one. Okay. 
how adorable how adorable is this little bag look at the side of it and you guys I didn't have not one bag with any kind of animal print on it and when I saw it well I've I saw this one online. I thought this is the cutest and it's small because you know, but it's a good little date night bag, girls night out bag like I ever do that. But anyway, <laughs> but it's a cute little bag, 40% off. Not sure what I paid for it. Not even a hundred dollars probably. So I got these two bags and it's something totally different because I really want some animal print in my bag collection and I really wanted it was a, it's the YSL there's a YSL bag with this print that I really want and it's twenty five hundred dollars and I just can't go there right now you guys so this is gonna quench my thirst for a while I love the shape of this I love this bag both of these bags I am totally totally stoked over and I do need to sit down and go over some of my bags with you guys. I need to go over my new Louis Vuitton bag. My, um, I need to get out the little Prada bag and compare it with this one. But you guys, I'm going to list all this stuff below. This Kate Spade bag, I got Autumn a black one and I got Winnie a pink one uh, for uh, their birthdays. And there was a really pretty black and white stripe. I almost got it, but when I saw this one, I put it back and got this one. So these are two little bags that, I don't know, I'm just really super excited. Let me give them the Autumn Beckman Spin. Yep, Autumn Beckman Spin, back and forth. Yep, there we go. How cute are these? Ah! I just, oh, how cute are, how cute are these bags? So yeah, I need to show you guys what all fits inside of them. It's just with Vlogmas. I don't have the time to come up here and do proper sit down videos. That's one reason I didn't even bother to decorate in here. And uh, I'm, I'm thinking about, I'm thinking about taking this out. It's driving me crazy and maybe having some shelves built here so I can um, maybe showcase some more bags, but I probably won't do that till the spring. There's just too much going on around here. But this drives me crazy because if I go back on my chair, I'm always knocking things over. So anyway, you guys, adorable, affordable, super cute. So check the description box and I'll have them linked below and hopefully they're still on sale. Okay. All right. So here he is. Here he is for now. I did start a little bit. I like threw some eyeballs in there. Just trying to cover up the canvas. I need to work on that. I think tomorrow I'm just going to come in here and work on his face and, and, and just get his face finished. That's not the way it's going to look. But I just wanted to put the placement of the eyes in. And uh, sometimes the canvas will totally drink up that oil paint. But anyway, that's what I've got so far. And I will show you guys some more progress. Yeah. So I'll show you guys some more progress as I finish the painting. Oh my gosh. I just remembered something. I'll be right back. I have to go get something out of my office. All right. So I just remembered I have another giveaway. And it's from Dress Up Your Purse, you guys. So I always link them with my discount code in the description box. Any and everything you could ever want to dress up your purse or put inside of your purse or organize your purse is on that website. So this is a pretty item that I got. And it's just something kind of different, I thought. It is a beautiful suede tassel. Look at that pink. It's suede. It is so luxurious. <sighs> I'm tempted to keep it. <laughs> I'm that way. I love to buy gifts, but then I'm always tempted to keep it. So it's a beautiful tassel. This would go on just about, oh, it would be gorgeous on a black bag, a navy bag, any bag. So it's a beautiful suede tassel with this beautiful silky dress up your purse. 
drawstring bag, okay? But that's not all. I have one other item that I wanted to share, and it is the Louis Vuitton sample perfume, the Rose de Vence. And I've had this perfume and I love it. It smells divine. The only thing, to be honest, on me, it does not last. Now my daughter, she loves it. She said it does. I guess it's just my body chemistry. But I do love it and it's beautiful. So I'm gonna pop that down in this dress up your bag drawstring. Dress up your purse drawstring bag. Bam. And this is the giveaway. Okay, so I want you to say, use the word BAM in a sentence. <laughs> wonder what made me come up with that idea. <laughs> use the word BAM in a sentence in any way, okay? You can say Yota is so BAM, anything you want to say, okay? Yota is more BAM than Winnie because Yota won Queen. Vlogmas Queen 2021. Just use the word BAM. And this is the giveaway. I will give this away on Wednesday, okay? Use the word BAM. Okay, so that's all I have for you guys today. I love you guys. Thank you for supporting me. It takes me a while to get back to your comments, but I'm trying to answer everybody. Just give me, Cut me a little slack, guys, because this is getting intense. All right, so I love you guys, and I will see you tomorrow. Peace out.